What's going on? It is currently 5.54 and I am at Mammoth. Uh, a little hard to see. Um, yeah, we're at Mammoth. I got here a little past 11.30, like 11.40 last night. Of course, slept in the truck, which wasn't bad, but it wasn't great either. Um, and then they started knocking on people's windows at like almost five, like right, right before five o'clock, and started doing signups and all that. I was sign signing in and all that, and the line moved before the gates open. The gates are supposed to open at 5.30. We start, we were moving in line at like 5.15, 5 o'clock almost, is when the line started to move, so. This is the earliest I've ever been in here. Um, it is the first race day of the week, which is vet weekend, because I turned 30. If this race was when it was supposed to be in June, at the end of June, I would have had to raise a 25 plus class, but since it's after July, I turned 30, so now we're racing 30C, 30C, so. And it's a two day, or it's two days, so it's racing today, uh, two heats, LCQ main, and then tomorrow the same thing. I have to go figure out what division I'm in and all that, and check in with registration, with my transponder and all that, and should be good at that point, but. Yeah, so for the earliest I've been in here and set up, it's almost six and the bike and all that is set up back there. Canopy set up and all that, so we're all set there. It's a little chilly. It's not terrible, but it's a little chilly. And yeah, we'll see how today goes. It's going to be a long weekend, so I have all day today. Then I have to screw around in town for a few hours before it gets dark and then come sit in line again and then we'll do it again tomorrow. So how much I film... I'm not sure <laughs> how much this camera's gonna get. I'm not sure either because the battery will probably die before tomorrow or it will die tomorrow. So, yeah, uh, I'm gonna go get signed up. I know I'm first practice and that's really all I know. Oh, I know the race schedule too. I'm like race, I'm either one of the first two races, I think. Uh, I am either the second or third race, so division one or division two there. And then depending on how I finish that, I'm then race number 12, which is the LCQ. And then after that, it is race number 22 out of 25. There's only 25 motos, so five laps each. So we should be pretty good. Last year, we were doing seven for the 25 plus class. So this year, doing five. I should be a little bit better. I'm only doing two motos. I'm only doing the heat LCQ main. So I'm only doing one class. I'm not doing four motos like I have been. I like swap, so we should be good there as far as like being able to uh, uh, keep on it. So when it gets a little bit light out, we'll, we'll, we'll sh I'll be back. <laughs>
missed my one practice, just one practice, and I do one practice and I already, oh, I didn't do it. But, freaking, it's, one practice, it's cold, that's why, I got hit by a rock and freaking busted the number plate up, so. I'm gonna have to like, I'll put some electrical tape around it, I think, to make it look better, but. I was like, oh, it's kind of, I did one, like, hold on, I did one practice session and it already, it already messed it up. I'm like, man. But yeah, new graphics. And I'm wearing a newer jersey, a new jersey. Newish, I mean, I bought it when I went to the Fast House sale, so. Uh, yeah, and there's a track for today. And first practice is so much fun. Because track is like perfectly smooth here's wide open everywhere hitting all the jumps uh, the only one jump that's kind of sketchy is there's a the rhythm section it's always a rhythm section back there and um, they always do it differently every year and this year it's like you come out of the corner you have a little bit of runway thankfully years past it was like come out of the corner and jump right away right now I have a little bit of runway you have a double another double and if you're fast enough or if you're good enough you can triple out there's like a roller triple thing and right now I'm tripling I'm just barely making it though I'm like landing on top of it and getting the front wheel over but it's landing on top of it so and then the, if you're not ready for it you're off the back of the bike and then the corner after that's pretty quick so so far we're uh, we're doing it so we'll see how my race goes it's not gonna be it's not gonna be this nice for long so go we'll figure out what what division I'm in so if I race, race two or three and uh, go from there I guess so far I'm having fun because the tracks really nice I'm pretty sure my mood will change later but I'll also be able to see a lot better later because the Sun where the Sun is right now you can't see crap coming into a couple of these corners you can't see nothing you're like going straight into the Sun so and I'm just kind of bummed up my number plate <laughs> thankfully I already have another one I so when I did this graphics set, I did two. I did one with a specific Mammoth logo on top, and I did another one with my normal USA flag that I had from last time. So now, well, when I get back to when I get back, we'll change it over. So go figure out where I what race I'm in and uh, go from there, I guess. Super stoked and bummed at the same time. So, uh, get up to the gate. They, they, we draw numbers. I get gate pick 36. And because I was on the outside, the dudes that standing there like, see me on my helmet and they're like, they're like, you can't have any GoPro. I'm like, really? And like, I know I'm not supposed to. It's a stupid AMA rule. This is the AMA race. So like, you can't have a GoPro. I'm like, so mad. So I, I, they made me take it off. I gave it to them. I went, went back and got it. But yeah, so I had a race without the GoPro. And I'm stoked because that was the best start I've ever had at this track. 30, 36 gate, which is all the way far right. I was the only one out there. Everyone else was like further inside of me. And I just got a really good jump off the gate. And it was full throttle up the hill. And as soon as I got up the little first little like flat spot, like roller over, I just cranked it to the left and and all the way up and I was second. At the top of the hill I was second. I'm like, holy crap, this is awesome. And I held second for a whole lap. And then uh, a couple guys started getting around me. Like, um, so I was like, since we were first practice, the track was perfect, right? And now they've done all the practices. They did one race in front of us. So now we're, you know, a few races in, there's lines and stuff now starting to develop. And I come around one of the corners, the, the tree turn. 
and the main line that I was used to riding has a big old retinue. I kind of like get crossed up in it a little bit, and a couple guys got by me, and then a couple guys got me in some other spots, and I I got to the point where they stopped coming by me, and I got I was like kind of held my own into a spot, so and I was like, holy crap! I did have the best start I've ever had, and freaking. I slowly fell backwards, but I was like, I'm doing good. And of course, I don't have a GoPro to like film any of those, so I'm so bummed on that. Uh, man, I don't know what to do now. I, I can maybe see about getting like a chest mount and get some footage. Maybe I'll go ask the GoPro guy so I can buy a chest mount because they're here. I was like, oh, this is so good, and freaking. Great start from all the way out there though. I'm happy with that. I'll take that all day. So I'm pretty sure I made it to the main event on that. I don't think I fell back far enough to like lose a transfer spot. So I think I'm good there. <sighs> the only kind of virus attack's gonna be all messed up even more, so I just gotta get another good start and just kinda hold my own. I'm looking for really like top ten, I think, and that's where the bears come in. It's like top that one. I don't care for a big one. I just want something. I'm gonna go talk to the GoPro guy. Well, the weekend might be saved. <laughs> so I went and found. I went and talked to the GoPro guy, and he's like, they don't sell them here, and they, but they sold them at the, 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 the vendor booth selling trailer. So I got a bra on now. It's not perfect. It's not like what I want. But uh, at least I'll get footage from the main and then tomorrow's activities. So. It is what it is, I guess. For now, I wear the bra. I don't like it. Either. I just don't like the way it looks. We'll see how the POV is. Um, I think it might be okay, but I kind of lined it up as best I could, so we'll see. And, and, I finished seven. So, second place start, I did. That was good, and then I started slowly falling back and learning the tracks. Second place start, good there. And I finished seventh, so.
man. What a freaking day. Uh, so, where are we? Uh, second moto, or main event. Main event, because we did heat, qualified out of that. Straight to the main event. I uh, didn't get the same start I did it like in the first one. Damn sure for that one. I got off the gate good, and I was going up the hill, and I started to kind of curve to the left, and as soon as I did that, the guy on my, to my left of me was like there, and I hit, he hit me or bumped into each other, and I was full on like wheelie over the thing, like staying on it, and it was like I was going to crash if I didn't uh, chop the throttle and, and kind of pivot and, and turn or whatever, so didn't get the greatest start there. Then one guy fell on top of the hill, like I said, we went up, up with a little bump and turn. He fell, one guy fell there. Another guy fell into him, and then coming around the next turn off the drop off where the whole shot line is, there's like four or five guys that completely yard sailed right there. And uh, passed all those guys, and I was doing okay. And, and I didn't even know where I was at that point, honestly. I was just like, all right, just doing best I can kind of thing. And I think uh, I think one or two guys passed me at that after that. And I ended up finishing 10th. 10th, just, just barely. Because there's the guys that are on my butt the entire time. I could hear them back there. And I knew they were back there. And a couple guys got around me, but I, but I finished 10th. And I got, I got, I got, I got a bear. I wasn't even expecting to try to get a bear, to be completely honest. And I got a little bear. It says, oh, I can't, I don't know if you can see it very well. Yeah, it's a bear. Look at that. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool. Day one, 30C, 10th. So, just barely. Ha, 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 Just barely. Get it? Uh huh. Okay. Um, yeah, just barely. Squeaked out a 10th. I was surprised. They only trophy out to 10, so I was like, I got, I actually got a bear. I was gonna make the joke, like, we're gonna go bear, not hunting, we're not hunting bear, we're looking for bears. Not even looking, we're seeing spotting, bear spotting, that's what I was thinking. I was gonna make the joke earlier, like, we're going bear spotting, see if we can even see one, and uh, we actually got one. So I actually got, I got a bear, which is really cool. I'm, I'm super happy about this. I was beat by the end of that moto. From, from the first practice to when we raced, which is race 22, the track changed a lot. Even in my heat, the track changed and I wasn't ready for some of the changes. And that's why I lost some spots and going back to seventh. So, um, I guess they do an over a weekend overall too. So like, like a two moto format, two, two main formats. So I have a 10th. And if I do better or worse or somewhere, I might be able to get another 10th overall or, uh, yeah, or another, I might get another one. Just saying. I'm not, I'm not saying I will, but I might. <laughs> there's a, there's a, a possibility. I was going to get a start like I did in the first row. That's really what I got to do, so. Whew, what time is it? It's kind of late already, which is nice because of I got nothing but time now. So it's five o'clock. I'm gonna go uh, probably find some dinner and something to eat because I'm hungry. I haven't really eaten much today. I had snacks here, and then we're gonna eat dinner. We're gonna chill out there, and then we are going to go sit back in line and do this all again tomorrow. See you. Guys. I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow morning at five a.m. or something like that.